You know where you are. This is Nollywood Pictures team. Are you Mr. Samuel? Why are you looking for Mr. Samuel? Mm. Your voice betrays you. It sounds as if you are the man I seek. Confirm that you are the man I seek and I will give you the, your message. Alright. I am Mr. Samuel. Who sent you to me and why? I am Ogbuefi Odunze, the chief messenger of Ogbuezie Beshrine. The deity that takes a man's life at the very peak of it does not a man's life when it is sweetest to him. Well, like I said before, you are in the wrong place. Yes. I'm a Christian. I'm not fetish. Somebody reported you to Ogugwe Zieve Shrine. That you diverted the money meant for you and him into an account that belongs to you and your wife. That is after much pleadings that you give him his share. With due respect to you, sir, you are talking arrant nonsense. This is a letter from the chief priest of Ogugo. The gods will judge this case, but he wants to hear from you. That is law and justice of Ogugo, the seat of justice. I advise you. It will be risky to discountenance the content of this letter. Well, sir, let me make it clear to you. I am a Christian. I am not fetish. I will not appear at your shrine. And like I said before, you are talking arrant nonsense. Your countenance gives you away. I can see that you have something to hide. Be warned. Ogugu takes a man's life at the very peak of it. Snuffs a man's life when it is sweetest to him. I advise you, Mr. Samuel, Come and speak for yourself. Speak for yourself before it is too late. Now take. Take your letter. I have all the damn documents in my possession. So stop provoking your lies. The money was wired into our account on the 11th by 9 a.m. And at 1 p.m. you moved the money from our account to your account, the buyer's bank. An account that you jointly operate with your wife. So why are you denying? I'm not denying. Fact is, I don't know what you're talking about. You don't know what I'm talking about. Listen to me, Samuel. I have labored with you for six solid years in this our business partnership. We've worked together as brothers and during this period we really didn't realize anything. Samuel, this is the first solid money we've made and I want to assure you that you cannot steal. Why are you calling me? I told you, the money was not paid in the first place. I've not seen any money. I, I don't know what you're talking about. Do you know you know me? You know me, I won't steal your money. All right, fine. Since you want to believe I stole your money, go to hell. Go to hell. I should go to hell. Good, son. Let me tell you, the bread tastes deceit. It's bitter in the mouth. I'm going to show you the true meaning of that bravo. Take and pose, you come, they take me, they play. You cheat 
me, my friend. I'm ready for you. On top of my money, hey, you come they make it younger. Now so you treat me, you don't they look for trouble, oh. When trouble wake ye, now I holla be that. You don't they form for me, you don't they show body, ye. Eh. When trouble wake ye, now I holla be that. Make you pay me, make you give me my money. Now they walk where you walk, now they walk. Now they chop where you jump, I go jump. He don't forget the past, the way we used to struggle. No. He don't they chop money, you don't forget body. You did me, my friend. You don't they show yourself. Hello? I'm very close to you, just hold on. Listen, you have to be fast. My heart is tearing to pieces. I need someone to talk to. I, I'm not comfortable with the tone of your voice. I just wanted to hold on. Where exactly are you right now? I am coming. Be fast. What happened? You sounded so, so bad on the phone. What is the problem? Wednesday, I swear. I'm going to kill that man. I swear to God, I will kill him. Who do you want to kill? What is the problem here? Samuel. Samuel, of course. My business partner. The same old Samuel that I put my trust in, all my trust I have in this world. He wants to kill himself, but I'm going to help him do that faster. There is something I am not getting here. I want you to explain it to me. Why would you want to kill your partner somewhere? Why? Listen. I have made 500,000 euros with someone. And it was agreed that 30% of that amount is for me. Suddenly, the money vanished. The money disappeared from the account of which the money was transferred to. This is serious. And the most annoying thing is, someone is telling me the money was never cited in that account. You know the tracer, the tracer that I gave you? Yeah. The tracer is from the same bank where the money was transferred. The, the, the documents I have from the bank, they are all certified copies. There is a confirmation that the third money was credited into that account on the 11th by 9 a.m. on the dot. And from my preliminary investigation, that same day on the 11th, the money was transferred from that account to another account at the buyer's bank. And do you know whose account? No. To an account jointly owned by Samuel and his wife. <laughs> Ever since we opened this, this football scouting office, we have been sending boys in and out to Europe. All of them went on trials. Not until this one. This is the first big money we are making. And Samuel wants to die with it, and I'm ready to make him die with that money. Oh, 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 oh. Hold on. Have you discussed this with him? And he failed to own up. Of course I did. But someone is telling me the money was never cited into that account. With all the evidence I have, the evidence shows that he's denying. But he doesn't want to accept it. But I'm ready for him. <laughs> this is very dangerous. But let me ask you. Have you talked to his wife? Have you discussed this with his wife? Discuss what with his wife? Listen, I don't like discussing business with women. For women is not proper. That is why you're making a mistake. We are talking about your partner's wife. It is very, very important, imperative, necessary that you must let her know. So that let her not say tomorrow I was not told.
I use for it is It is important. They want to know. Yeah, honey, what's happening? I'm just coming from the buyer's bank. And why did you go to do that? Honey, are you aware of the huge deposit in the account? Listen, I don't know exactly why you went to the bank, but know this. I know about the huge money there. Don't touch it. Don't withdraw from there. We'll talk about it when I get back. Okay. Why can't this woman just, just, just stay one place? Life not teacher, you say you be my party. This one you they show, not be so we take plan. I bring the deal, I bring better for table low. You come they take and pose, you come they take me they play. You cheat me my friend, I'm ready for you. On top my money, hey. You come they make it younger. Now so you treat me. You don't they look for trouble, oh. When trouble wake ye, now I love that. You know they form for me. Where have you been? Uh, I've been around, you know, workload, who <laughs> permit me to come and see you. But nevertheless, I'm, I sincerely apologize for you. It's nothing, really. <laughs> but why, why are you standing outside? Oh, please, come in. I'm surprised to see you. <laughs> are we safe? Oh, yeah, madam, you're definitely safe. It's just that I am presently having a slight problem with your husband. And it's a problem that just might, I mean, destroy our partnership. Please, tell me, what's the problem? You see, madam, ever since we formed this uh, partnership, we have lived and um, related like brothers. And others envy I will understand. Last month, we um, we made a sum of five hundred thousand euros, and then, and that was because we actually sent five boys to Germany for trials, and the five boys passed the trial. I mean, without any problem. But before that, we have sent some other boys, but they all failed. Now, the football club in Germany paid us, at least they paid a commission of 100,000 euros for each of the boys. They wired this money into our account. <clears throat> now, my problem I have with your husband is that this money is missing. And everything point to the fact that your husband moved the money from our account into another account in the buyer's bank. An account jointly operated by you and your husband. I've talked to him about it, but he refused. He refused to grow up. I'm, I'm sorry, Mr. Jidofo. Are you sure? I mean, my husband would never do anything like this. Are you sure the money is in our joint account at the buyer's bank? Madam, as the head of our partnership, he was the one who kept the telegraphic uh, uh, and, and form from Germany. And he was the one who monitored the transfer. Usually it takes four working days for a transfer to be cleared. And now after seven working days, I met him, I confronted him. And he told me he has never cited the money in our account. 
And after seven working days, I, I, I became curious. So I sent an email to, to, to the football club in Germany and they, 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 they replied the bank. When I got to the bank, they gave me a tracer. And the tracer showed me that this money was paid by 9 a.m. on the 11th. So I was shocked to myself. And then I went on, on my background investigation and met our account officer. And he told me that our code was used by my partner, which this code was used to move this money from our account into another account at the buyer's bank. And this was done on the same day, on the 11th, by 1.05 p.m. Um, I'm sorry, Mr. JJB, but from everything you have said now, it's obvious you have fallen into the hands of some fraudsters. Fraud? Madam, madam, please, without due respect, I'm not a fool not to know that this has got nothing to do with fraud. Your husband moved the money from our account into another account, an account you both operate. I'm just coming from the bank, and I did check the balance. Such huge sum was never deposited into the account. It wasn't. <laughs> well, if you are sure about what you're saying, that means the same finger that removed the money from our account has moved it from that account to an account or somewhere else. I don't know. But let me just give you a piece of advice that you can give your husband. Tell him he can have his 70%. I don't need a penny from that seventy percent. Let him just give me my thirty percent. That is, that's all I'm asking. Give me my thirty percent. I just told you my husband did not see any money. Aren't you listening? There's no money in the account. He didn't see any money. There's no money. So go and look for the money where you kept it. Or I don't know. There's no money. Well, madam, I repeat. Tell your husband I don't want a penny from his seventy percent. Let him give me my third person. He's still not with anyone. Okay. What is it again? They know everything. I don't know how you're going to handle this. What are you talking about? You know what I'm talking about. They know everything and the location. Mm. Listen, I, I don't know what you're going to do. Mm. Hey! You see it? Hello? Hello? The guilt is all over your continents. All over your continents, please, I beg you in the name of God, tell your husband to give me my 30%. That's what I'm asking from him. Let him give me my 30%, else I will do everything, every power I have to do in this world to get back my 30%. I don't know what you want me to say. I just told you, he doesn't have your money. Wednesday, 30%. Don't worry. Everything. He traced the money to our joint account. It sounded really me, and he came with some dangerous looking guy. Oh. You know the guy he came with? No, I don't know him. But he looked every inch a criminal. First thing tomorrow morning, I'll move that money to another account. Good. Perfect. If a snake doesn't swallow another snake, it won't grow. I am behind you. Thank you. And they come to you again. Insist on what you said. You don't know anything about the money. You talk to me, I don't know. I don't know anything about the money. I don't. Of course you don't. <laughs> Do you know that I couldn't sleep last night? 
because of what you told me. This is rubbish, arrant nonsense. I have never seen this kind of thing before. I am telling you that I'm making contact on how to go about this thing. I'm making contact. Well, there is no need for that. I truly, uh, I am, um, I've called my lawyer. You know, I'm suing him for betrayal of partnership. This is rubbish. Nonsense. Listen to yourself. How do you intend to sue somebody with that kind of amount of money? Do you hope to get justice? You seem to be living in the land of fantasy. The law is there to protect the rich. You don't listen. Going to court is as good as losing that money. You're just simply losing. You see that money, the money will just walk away from you. In that case, you continue to linger from 10 years, 15 years, and thereabout. Boy, thank you. Thank you. No, <coughs> it's more like you don't get it. I, uh, I actually obtained a diploma in law. You understand? And I have so much respect and I believe in the course of law. Bullshit. Rubbish. That is nonsense. Law no, doesn't count when money counts. You are entitled to your own opinion. You know, let us look for this money the African way. Let us get this money the African way, if you understand what I mean. What? What? What do you mean by the, the African way? Now listen to me, just in case if you don't understand. In the course of my vast experience last night, I came up with an issue. Shrine. There is a place I will take you, a particular shrine I will take you. That money, that 30% will just come out in 30 days. It will just come out. Men, they were cheated like you. Went to this shrine and the money came out within 30 days. No, I don't think that's a very good idea. You know, I'm a, I'm a Christian, man. What am I going to do to a shrine? For what? Huh? Ah, uh, Jidao, for... Men that control the finances of this nation do not discuss religion. An ingrate, a bastard, an idiot, somebody you did business with, and that money paid. They wired the money into account. He cornered that money and put it in his own account with his wife. He's trying to cheat you and you're telling me about Christianity and whatever. Bros, let us fight this bastard to stand still. You know, somehow I'm so surprised that you of all people would suggest such a thing. Why would you suggest that we go to a shrine? There's there always another way. We could always make another way. Now, I'm not going to go to a shrine. Come on, man. Why would we go to a shrine to do work there? There is no other way to get this money. And what was also? I am involved in this case. I am deeply and rooted involved. That bastard must be dealt with. There is no other way. Jidofo, I read those documents. I am coming to pick you here early in the morning, 6 o'clock. We must look for that money the African way. You see that bastard? He, he believes he can get away. Maybe he used to get away with, with other things. But you see this one? We are going to trap him to stand sick. He must provide that money. Not what means it's involved. Are ready? Where, 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 where has it come back? Come. See, eh? the man will not only vomit something, but he will also spend a huge sum of money from his own shell just to settle the shrine. Okay, Kaka, are we getting closer? Yes, that tree in front of you, just park under the tree, then we walk the rest. Walk again. Do you know, relax your mind. I can see your partner loves water, but the water will soon begin to boil. By then, he will know that even fishes and frogs love water, but not when the water gets hot. I can see he's, he must for me something. Relax. I don't know the man, but definitely I can see him vomiting things. Like my teacher, you say you be my party. This one you they show, not be so we take plan. I bring the deal, I bring better for the 
table, oh. You come, they take and pose. You come, they take me, they play. You cheat me, my friend. I'm ready for you. On top of my money, hey. You come, they make it younger. Now, so you treat me. You don't, they look for trouble, oh. When trouble wake, yeah. Now, I'll be that. You know, they form for me. You don't, they show body, yeah. When trouble wake, yeah. Now, I'll be that. Make you pay me. Make you give me my money. Now they walk where you walk, now they walk. Now they chop where you jump, I go jump. He don't forget the past, the way we used to struggle. No. He don't they chop money, you don't forget body. You did me, my friend, you don't they show yourself on top of my money. Yeah. You, come you are welcome. This is Ogubwe Zebe Shrine. You are expected to come into the shrine with an open heart. Yes, we are here with open hearts. Are we allowed into the shrine? Yes, uh, the shrine welcomes all men of goodwill. You are welcome. But first, uh, take off your shoes. Take them off. Mm -hmm. You expected to stand in full communion with Ajana, the mother goddess, the owner of the whole earth. And you must do that barefooted. Yes, that's good. Uh, wait for me, I'm coming. Here, thick, thick, cleansing water. The water that cleanses and purges the whole earth. Use it and cleanse yourself. Hmm? For you must stand before the shrine cleansed. That's right. all you said. However, we must hear the other side. That is the cardinal part of justice administration. Hear the other side. You are going to provide us with the information how we are going to reach your colleague. And if possible, reach his family members. Whatever information you want me to provide, I'm, I'm ready to provide. I just need my money, that's all. Oh, Gugu. I will not allow you to go empty-handed. As long as the money belongs to you, you must have that which is yours. You say you be my party. This one you they show. Not be so we take plan. I bring the deal. I bring better for table. Low. You come, they take and pose. You come, they take me, they play. You cheat me, my friend. I'm ready for you. On top of my money. Hey. You come, they make it younger. Now, so you treat me. You don't they look for trouble, oh. When trouble wake, yeah. Now, I'll be that. You don't they form for me. You don't they show body, yeah. When trouble wake, yeah. Now, I'll be that. Make you pay me. Make you give me my money. Now, they walk where you walk. Now, they walk. Now, they chop where you jump. I go jump. You don't forget the past. The way we used to struggle, oh, you don't they chop money. You 
You say you're looking for Mr. Samuel? Yes. Why? Are you Mr. Samuel? Why are you looking for Mr. Samuel? Mm. Your voice betrays you. It sounds as if you are the man I seek. Confirm that you are the man I seek and I will give you the, your message. Alright. I am Mr. Samuel. Who sent you to me and why? I am Ogwefi Odunze, the chief messenger of Ogwezie Beshrai. The deity that takes a man's life at the very peak of it that snuffs a man's life when it is sweetest to him. Well, like I said before, you are in the wrong place. Yes. I'm a Christian. I am not fetish. Somebody reported you to Ogwezie Beshrai. That you diverted the money meant for you and him into an account that belongs to you and your wife. That is after much pleadings that you give him his share. With due respect to you, sir, you are talking arrant nonsense. This is a letter from the chief priest of Ogugo. The gods will judge this case, but he wants to hear from you. That is law and justice of Ogugo, the seat of justice. I advise you. It will be risky to discountenance the content of this letter. Well, sir, let me make it clear to you. I am a Christian. I am not fetish. I will not appear at your shrine. And like I said before, you are talking arrant nonsense. Your countenance gives you away. I can see that you have something to hide. Be warned. Ogugu takes a man's life at the very peak of it, snuffs a man's life when it is sweetest to him. I advise you, Mr. Samuel, come and speak for yourself. Speak for yourself before it is too late. Now take. Take your letter. Take it. Take it. The very earth on which I stand bears witness that I have delivered the letter to the rightful owner. And your spirit bears witness that you have received the letter. Oh, Gugu! I go. He goes to report you at some stupid shrine? My goodness! This is the time to do something. We have to act and fast. We can't allow the devil to triumph over us. He doesn't deserve that 30%. He doesn't. Okay. I am not holding brief for anybody in this matter. But it's just impossible that your partner can just accuse you of diverting the money if there's no such thing. Mr. Samuel, I am your pastor. And I ask you to tell me the truth. The whole truth. Pastor Mark, the Lord knows that everything I'm going to tell you right now is the truth. Everything. I do not know anything about this money. There was no transfer into my account. I've not seen any money. Nothing. You can even ask my wife here. My wife is seated right here. We don't know anything about this money. Nothing. I've written a letter to the company in Germany and they said they'll investigate the issue. But I don't, I don't know why Jidofo will be doing this. Why is he taking my name to a shrine? Why? I love taking this in. Take it easy. Why, why, why are you fidgety? Why are you looking like uh, the whole world has crumbled on you? What, what's the problem? A certain man that introduced himself as um, Ubu Ifiodunze came to my house a couple of minutes ago. Ubu Ifi... Ubu Ifiodunze. That's the same man that has been going around as the messenger of the gods. Oh. You know him? He just left before your arrival. Brother Clem, he came to you also. What 
are we going to do? He said a whole lot of things. I'm very confused now. See, I, I wouldn't want to rush into taking any decision. I'm a thoroughbred African and a mature one at that. Um, let's, let's, let's just uh, wait. Let's wait. Wait? wait? Just uh, let me, let me think. Let me just think. It's okay. I'll get the prayer warriors to provide this matter. There's nothing to worry about. If what you're telling me is the truth, I'll ask you to hold yourself and watch the man of war in action. Excuse me, my brother. Hello? Hello, brother. This is your sister. Where are you? Oh, my dear sister. Are you all right? I should be asking you, where are you? Oh, I'm, I'm fine. Why would you ask that? Hmm. A certain man served me a letter from the shrine. I came here to discuss with our big brother and was shocked to find out he was served the same letter. What is wrong with you, Doctor? What is wrong with this guy? Why, why is he just spreading this? What? Oh, look, sister, just, just hang on there. I'm coming. Okay? I said, just hang on. I'm coming. I'm, I'm coming over right now. Okay, please hurry. Be careful. All right. What did you say? He's on his way. Oh, Jesus. What is wrong with this guy? This guy is crazy. Why? Why is he reporting me to my family members? Why? So that is not a problem. The Bible said they will come in one way. But the Lord will scatter them in seven ways. As long as you are sure that what you told me in fellowship with the Lord is the truth. There's nothing to fear for. Mr. Mark, but I have said it before. I am not lying. I'm not lying to you. I cannot lie. I can't lie to you. I'm telling you the truth. Do you think I'll be here with my wife and be lying? God forbid it. God forbid it, Pastor. Okay, I believe you. Go in peace. And may the Lord be with you. You see, this is very simple. It's, it's nothing to be worried about. If you are sure you don't have the money, you are sure you have not even cited, you say you've not cited the money. Huh? So go to the shrine and explain yourself. Brother, I say no. Big no. I will not get myself entangled in some, some shrine, chief priest, whatever. I was with my pastor when your call came in and he made it clear to me, he advised me, he said I shouldn't go. Are they asking you to come and become a shrine worshipper? Are they asking you to come and, 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 and bow for the chief priest? Your partner complained about you. He said that you had a windfall from Germany. And contrary to your agreement, you have refused to give him his share. Why are you smuggling religion and faith into all of this? Why are you so bothered about this rubbish Jidolfo said? I am the principal partner in this partnership and I'm still telling you there was no money. Mind you, that's the reason you should go there and explain going. yourself. I'm not doing it. You will have to go there. was no... You did, will not, you did, did you see any money? Was there anything there? Brother, if he is sure that there was no money that came from Europe, then he should not entangle himself with the idols. Thank you, sister. One can even contact demons by mere appearances such deadly animals. Hey, hey, shut up, shut up. Do you, do you know what, what demons are? Huh? Do you know what tradition is all about? Huh? Since our parents died, I have assumed the position of the head of this family. And I should have a say. And my say should stand. And it's for the good of all of you. Uh, anyway, for you, I have made my point. If you choose to go, good for you. And if you choose not to go, whatever happens to you and your wife, Count me out. You're telling me uh, demons and traditions. Do, do, do you know what demons are? Have you seen a demon before? 
and sense. So tell me, did you play school today? Huh? You don't want to talk to me, Abby. Hmm? Mm. You don't want to talk to me. Did you play in school today? I'll not give you another app. If you don't talk to me, I will not give you another app. Tell me, did you play in school today? Hmm? Please eat. No, 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 don't worry. Don't worry. I've had something to eat. Oh. It is just an apple. <laughs> of course I know it's an apple. Will you tell me? I know what it is. Don't worry. I don't want to take Please eat a little bit from it. No. Thanks. I'm fine. Please. Okay. Thank you. To eat the apple. I told her I didn't want to eat the apple. She insisted or, or that, that I, I, I should eat it. And then I took a bite. Then all of a sudden I noticed there were maggots. Maggots in the apple. And then I turned around and she was gone. It's an ordinary nightmare. No. Just go to bed tomorrow. We'll go see the pastor. No, 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 no. You don't, you, you don't get it. I, I, I actually ate, I ate this apple, I, I ate the maggots. Yeah, it's good to bed. Oh. It's a dream. Please sit up. No, I'm tired. Please sit up. No. Sit up, sit up, sit up. Listen. Honestly, I'm no longer comfortable with this. Believe me, I am scared. I'm no longer comfortable with this. T tomorrow, we'll go for the meeting at the shrine. Give this guy his money, let him just go. No, no please. No, 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 I said no, 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 let him go. No, no, we're not going to the shrine, you're not giving him any money. If I say I'm surprised, uh, <clears throat> it will be an understatement. I'm actually stunned. I'm stunned at the, the revelation that I'm getting here. Well, the money actually hits our account by 9 a.m. on the 11th. And by 1.05 p.m., this money was moved from our account into another account. An account jointly operate by by Samuel and his wife. You 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 don't even have to worry about that. Uh, the the whole evidence is, is in print. I can see it. I mean, I can see it myself. The banks wouldn't lie. What I don't understand is, is why he's denying. Why is it? Why is he denying? Hmm. I have been so worried about my brother. See, that woman he's marrying will ruin him. I told him. I told him that. My brother has turned into something else. Well, I, I, I only asked him for my 30%. The remaining 70%, he can have it. He can have it. Let him just give me what is mine. That's all. That's what I'm asking. But I... I'm optimistic you will get your 30%. I, I hope so. But my only problem with you was that you should have come to me before going to the shrine. Yeah, you, you are right about that. But I, I'm, I'm very sorry. But the truth is, I couldn't just sit back and watch myself losing 150,000 euros just like that. I understand. That's a lot of money. It's a lot of money. 
Well, no problem. Um... The meeting is for tomorrow. And um, I want to say clearly that I would only attend that meeting if he will be there. Okay? Because as far as this issue is concerned, I have done my best. The heavens be my witness. Anyway, um, drink. Let's drink something. And it doesn't stop us from drinking. But, uh, yeah, but at least you'll still be able to act in for my time. That's why I will be at the meeting. I will be at the meeting. I don't understand. I mean, I, I just don't get it. This whole thing still boils down to my table. I am the one that will help you, Samuel. Why are you here feeding me with lies? Brother, brother, I'm not lying to you. I, I'm, not, I'm shocked you don't believe me. I'm not lying. Hmm. I was with Gideon for, and he spoke very well with me. I am convinced that you have this money. Look, you're not being fair to me. To think that you believe Jidofo, a total stranger, and then you don't believe your own brother. Hmm. You see, I'm scared for you, Samuel. I am worried. I'm worried that you have allowed avarice to becloud your entire reasoning. Where did you get this greed from? Huh? Where did you get this greed from? You are not greedy in this family. Your greed cannot be traced to your wife, that wife of yours. She will ruin you if she hasn't. Anyway, it's important that you give this man his 30%. Give him his 30%. That's all he's asking. Ogugweziebe is a deadly shrine. Look, you are getting this whole thing mixed up. I can only give what I have. I cannot give what I don't have. I don't have this money. Period. You do not have the money. Okay. Um, you know what? I'm no longer interested in this. Uh, my hands are off. Since you're so obstinate and you have created the path to your own destruction, I wish you luck. I'm not hearing you say this. Are you right? My love, darling, business is consistency. You have to be consistent with your pronouncement. You said you never cited the money. You have to keep to your word. You'll blame yourself if you ever say you saw the money. I understand what you're saying, but it's not easy. It's easy. It's very easy. I called the agent in London today and he said the house is ready. If we want to pay cash, we'll pay 120,000 pounds. 
But if you want to pay for two years installment, then we'll pay £140,000. And I think we should just give them the whole money and take possession of the house immediately. Look at it this way. If you give GDL4 that 30%, then we can't seal the deal. No, all right, fine. I've thought about it. Straight. Have you thought about this? Tomorrow is the meeting at the shrine. What is going to happen to me? Forget those busybodies. They can't do anything. Nothing. Besides, Pastor asked us to pray. And we have. We are born of Christ. We walk by faith, not by what we see. They can't do anything. They can't. Give him 30%. You were the one who instituted the whole thing in the first place. It's your idea. The scouting was your idea in the first place. It's your brainchild. You've always shared your precedence with him. And then this first time you ask him, hold your peace, he wants to die. Now all the seminars, you sponsor it. Flight tickets, you pay it. Hotel bills, your bills, you pay it. And now he wants to die. You have to stand on your word. Yes. You have to show him that it's your decision. So next time, he won't joke with you. you can't take 30%. Think about the house in London. Dangerous people. They were armed to the teeth. They were chasing me. They were chasing me. They wanted to, they wanted to kill me. They almost killed me. I know. It's just a nightmare. Don't bloody tell me it's a nightmare. I was in two places here. Don't tell me it's a nightmare. Euros. Go on, check. I want you to keep that money with you in the house. Now the house in London is almost ready. I am going to do everything humanly possible to ensure that I get your visa out. I mean, I don't want you filling that interview again.